Hi guys, today is May 6th. It's a Wednesday. Just saying in case you know, kind of lost track. Some of us do, that's okay. Isn't it great when we kind of lose track? Cause that means it does not even matter. We were talking in our staff meeting yesterday about the calendar and I said, I don't, some days I don't know what my, what to do with myself because I look at my calendar at things I had planned and they're no longer. Normally I would be super, super duper busy at this time of the year with Mother's Day. Oh, y'all gonna miss our Mother's Day celebration so much. And with graduation, we miss that too. Um, Cause y'all remember, I've, I've been at that church for 15 years. I done raised these babies up now, come on. But anyway, I would be running myself to death trying to get everything done and, and I'm not, and it's weird. It's really weird. And every day is so funny because every day last week I would open up my calendar and think, what, 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 what can I do? And days don't, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what tomorrow brings because I, I can only focus on today. And it seems like I've read that somewhere. I don't know. Um, may have been the Bible. I read a lot. I don't know. But anyway... So, it's a hard lesson to learn, though, to be just focused on today and not worry about tomorrow. But, you know, we go through a lot of things that teach us that. Um, yesterday was my nine-year anniversary of being diagnosed with kidney cancer. And from what I remember during that time of nine years ago, um, I just remember it wasn't a time of panic. You know, it wasn't a time of being even scared, I don't think. I, I don't remember being scared. Um, I don't remember worrying if I was gonna live or die. I just knew I'd be healed, you know, one way or the other, right? So, and it, in my Facebook post yesterday, I, I mentioned that it was probably harder on my family than it was on me because they were worried. They could see things differently than I could. It, I was, I had to be in a, in a fight mode. And when you're in that fight mode, you guys know it's one day at a time. You're, you can only focus on today. And you can't worry about tomorrow at all because you've just got to get through the day. You gotta get through that pain and that sickness. And, and so my mind was only on today, kinda like now. My mind is only on today. I don't worry about tomorrow. Um, and it's, it's kind of nice. I got to tell you, I'm not saying that this, this world, this whole time we're living in is wonderful, but I'm saying we're here for a reason. And, and I always, you know, I said last week, I'm going to say it again this week. You can't miss that lesson that God is trying to teach you right now. Beg him for the lesson. Open your eyes for today. Um, he's not going to give you tomorrow's lesson today, and he's not going to repeat yesterday's lesson today. He's going to give you a brand new one, just like he gives us brand new peace and brand new forgiveness and brand new mercy every single day, and it's only for today. Now, y'all, if y'all were to hear right now, and I don't care, I don't care what kind of quarantine we're in. I know some of y'all are not even doing that anymore. That's okay. You do you. Um... But if y'all were to hear Hobby Lobby's reopening today, and I, I think it is, and they were having a one day only freebie, y'all would be out there like nobody business. Y'all wouldn't plan to go tomorrow. You wouldn't have been out there yesterday, but you would be out there today. So to get that freebie. So I want you to think today, concentrate on just today. Get your freebie today. God has it every day. But you know what? You can't worry about what kind of freebie you're going to get tomorrow. You can't worry about what kind of freebie you missed out on yesterday. You can only worry about your freebies today. And that's grace, hope, love, mercy, forgiveness. All those he gives us free today. And they're just for today. It's a 24-hour thing. We, you know, And he doesn't give us leftovers that we didn't pick up yesterday. He doesn't give us those again. He gives us, It's brand new, brand new stuff, guys. And he gives it to us every day. And we sometimes we miss out on that because we get up and we just start our day, right? And here lately we haven't had to, some of us haven't had to do that. We haven't had to get up and just rush into the day. 
we get up and rush into the living room or the porch or wherever, you know. So, today, only think about today, May, May 6th. That's it. That's, you know, shh. Only, only day I want you to think about. And I know that things are coming tomorrow. I know that some things you dread are coming tomorrow. Some things you look forward to are coming tomorrow. But you can't be looking at tomorrow thinking you're going to get your freebies today because you got to be looking at today to get those freebies. So don't miss those because they're way better than the Hobby Lobby ones, I'm just saying. And no, Hobby Lobby is not giving away anything free. I'm just, don't, don't go there today thinking they are because you'll be sadly mistaken. Get your freebies today. Look to God today. Only concentrate on today. That may, wait, waiting may not be so hard because what are you waiting for? It's already here. It's today.